So this is day two of our kind of absolutely mental Black Friday time. There's a real kind of buzz and a vibe here at the HQ and we're really putting the HQ to work today. Let me show you this, which is absolutely nuts. It's the first time for me that this HQ is really gonna earn her crust so to speak, this multi-purpose ground floor space, which, you know, it's kind of quite a big rental commitment for us, but suddenly will probably pay for itself with the events that we're holding here. Check this out. Oh, it's still going. We got ourselves our own TV studio. TV stroke drinking studio. <laughs> <laughs> so we're actually just using an iPhone to do the live streams. Uh, yeah, iPhone 10s and an iPad Pro with Switcher Studio. Okay. Uh, which is free app, but it's like subscription service for like thirty dollars a month. Okay. Then yeah, we rented out these AX1 Astera, I believe they're pronounced lights, controlled by yet another tablet of some kind that has an app that controls all of the colors. You can set all of these little animations, and so these are all triggered as one, two, three, four, five in a row. Excellent. And then, yeah, these are just our normal lights, normal kind of things. But it's great because what you're able to do is zoom in on the iPhone so it kind of cuts out this stuff up here, and it just yeah, really yeah. does look like a, a TV set. It's amazing. Mm. And then what are we doing with the sound here? We've got... Quite simple, we've just got one lav for you, yeah. and we've got a boom here, which we probably won't really need, but okay. setting it up anyway. <laughs> Great stuff. And then, how are you firing off the, because uh, tonight is, the large proportion of the content is actually pre-recorded out in LA. Yes. So yeah, how yeah. are you firing that off? Uh, so that is actually already preloaded onto the iPad, and you just trigger that using Switcher Studio, and then that just runs. At that point, we can kill the audio on your side, okay. uh, and the audio just runs straight out of the iPad, so it's its own little contained box. It's essentially an entire vision mixer and a broadcast machine in one app. And on stable? Yeah, yeah. Amazing. Yeah. Not any problems so far. Stuff. And what are we doing today, Lauren? We are, this is what I'm very excited for, is yeah. we're doing a workflow episode of Jeff Russo. And amazing. He talks through Star Trek Discovery. Fantastic. And it was amazing. He's also one of my favourite composers, so amazing. I was very excited. And what is that in the corner on the sofa? This is a limited edition signed record that Jeff gave us whilst we were there for one of our very lucky community Fantastic. watchers. Fantastic. Amazing. I know. Are we live on Facebook already? Uh, we will test, be. Test yeah, stream. we're doing a test. Oh, that, that was can a I test stream. So you, can you imagine? Yeah. Oh my no, God. So I didn't know, because I don't use Facebook, I don't know how it works, Josh. Well, you have to blur out what it is, otherwise everyone can see oh, our yeah, test, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, that's test true. site. Sorry? Are these very expensive, Ben? Uh, yes, they are incredibly expensive. Really? Uh, can I, do you know how much? They're £250 a day, and that is... What, for the whole set? Yes, yeah, right. yeah. Which, you know how much to buy them? Uh, about three grand. Okay. But, you can't buy them. I'm not as nervous today because uh, I'm just linking in and out and I'm reading some idiot boards that. Can I see my idiot boards? Can I actually see it? Yeah, you're going to have to come to basically. Can you read those from here? Yes, that's great. Thank you, Asper. So that's first link. Great. So no, carry on, Ben. Sorry. Are you doing a sign off after this? Yes, doing a sign off at the end. Yep, absolutely. So a slightly drunker sign off, I imagine. Five, four, three. Two. I think the stream went down. Don't worry, we were actually um, putting it up, so that's fine. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so the internet cut out just before my end link, which is fortunate because it was the worst link I've ever done in my very amateur career as a presenter. Good morning. Morning, sir. Uh, these were returned erroneously to my room, these purple trousers. They're not mine. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Tombola. Do we have enough cash? 
cameras? <laughs> Fucking hell. That's mental. There's a gallery in there, or will be a gallery. What's going on here? Fall control inside. What kind of desk is that? Beautiful Digico S21, as supplied by Chris Calico. With a motherfucking Bricasti! <laughs> Jesus, look at that! And what are we recording to? That. Yes. Which is? Being recorded for film, film and TV, track laying, software. It's good. Yeah, seven radio mics, full production, full double with other power redundant aerials. The works. Shirts, active tubes. <laughs> it's all good. Um, will we have time to sample that piano? Hello! Hello! I was just about to come find Hello, you. Aloha. I'll just dump, dump my stuff and I've just got to render out, a, well, just get set a film rendering. Right, what we're finding out is people aren't understanding how our collections work. If you own something that's in a collection and you want that collection anyway, do you have to basically buy that product again? And the answer is no. Just add it to your cart and it'll deduct what you already own from it at the discount. So definitely the best way of getting the discounts, but I just need to explain that because it's quite complicated to get your head around. So that's what I'm doing here now. <sighs> oh, oh, tongue twister. Really not very articulate. Paul is so much better at that kind of stuff than me. Right, the LCO are arriving very soon. And I've got to prepare for the live stream and an interview and hopefully we won't have another internet outage today, which we did yesterday. It's all looking moody in here. Yeah. You can really control the light in here, can't you? I know. How are you doing? Good to see you guys. You're all right. How's it all going? What do you think of our new HQ? And are you SD card recording as well? Yes, yeah, yeah. Obviously. So we're going to do a separate edited thing for yeah, YouTube. Yeah, yeah. So we'll match the match the live stream with uh, that's duplicated onto the recorder with the, the group. Amazing. No. We're going to we're going to start. With could, sorry, before we start, can we just just talk about the format? Yes, because of course. I've still not got it quite right. Yeah. Right. So Again, just going back to this original idea of inspiring people who wouldn't normally think of themselves as being able to create orchestral music. Is there any piece of advice for someone who, who's maybe watching this and going, I might actually try to write a piece of orchestral music, but I, I don't think I'm capable or able or deserve to. So this is how I felt when I was younger. Do you have any words of advice? Yeah, I'd say, first of all, that's a, that's a good place to start. If you feel like that and you're humble before you start doing it, you're probably going to write something good. <laughs> <laughs> not not with the crazy narcissistic cloak like, wearing. It would be great. Um, yeah. Um, but yeah, I, I think, especially, yeah, just, 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 just write. I um, say exactly that. Yeah. Start is the, it's the, it's the, God, the God. only word you can use because you can spend time thinking, oh, should I, shan't I? And actually, you, you might make mistakes, but if you don't make mistakes, you don't make anything. Absolutely. So, start. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I get from work. Every single time I work with an orchestra, the thing I come away, other than the kind of total joy and elation, is the wealth of knowledge I've gained every time is, is pretty insane. Yeah, today's a school day. <laughs> So we'll go. So YouTube launched. Uh, really, really proud of the uh, live stream we did today. Um, as I've mentioned before, our kind of mission is to inspire a generation of um, orchestral music makers. And I think that we finally hit 
a kind of a format which just hits that nail on the head. So I was actually quite moved. Uh, the team just pulled it out of the bag and um, the LCO are, are absolutely awesome. Um, their links below, we've done a sample library with them, links below, but also they've got so many amazing gigs coming up. So check out that website and if you're in London uh, around any of those kind of dates, I really humbly recommend you uh, go and see them. So it's time to join my wingman of absurdity. <laughs> it's live chat time.